Hey guys, it's Chloe and I'm here with celebrity hairstylist Angelo David and he is going to show you how to get Jessica Chastain's look from the Oscars. And this is our lovely model, Rachel. All right, so Angelo, why Jessica Chastain? Well, I thought she stood out last night. She was amazing. Her hair looked beautiful. And I love the whole Veronica Lake look. It was very old world. For me, it was a hit that night. And how hard is this look going to be for our viewers at home to recreate? I think it's just a simple few easy steps, and we're going to show you how to do it today. So what I did to prepare the hair, I used Angel David Premier Volume Spray and Zero Frizz on the ends. To recreate this look, you need a few simple tools. Curling irons, hairpins, product, brush, and a blow dryer. So what I did here was to create the part. And I like to have the part just off center of the eye, more towards the corner of the eye. So we're gonna get more of hair flowing from one side to the other. And then we're gonna move into utilizing our curling irons. I'll probably switch back and forth from a inch and a half to a two inch barrel. I am gonna start with section one, right here in the front, in the forehead area. Grabbing the hair, which is already prepped with product and hairspray. We like to use a little hairspray because it allows the curl and iron to give a firm hold. And I'm going to use the larger curl and iron, which is our two inch barrel. I'm going to start with bending the hair back. This is going back towards the crown area and away from the face. I'm not going to go too, too close to the root area because I want it to lay flatter on the top. I already created the base with some product. Removing the curl and iron, I will take this, keeping it in shape. I will take a pen or a clip and secure it. We will proceed going from front to back in two large sections. The sectioning does not have to be too clean. It's better if it's a bit more random. And we're going to smooth that out. This is a very important step. We're trying to create an S wave. So think of Veronica Lake, S wave. So we're gonna create it with the curl and iron. Our next section will come from right here. I'm gonna take it from between the, the recession area and the ear, right in the middle, angling back. We're gonna come in, rolling the curl and iron towards her face. And removing. Again, securing the hair with a pin. So following this S pattern shape, we're gonna create this S wave here. As you saw in the first section area, I made everything go back. This area I'm coming forward. This area I'm gonna come back. So this is allowing me to create this S shape in the hair. Once I release these waves, it's going to all fall into place. So again, we're going to take the curl and iron, going back. We will move on to this side of the head, and we're going to section this in a horizontal section. Clip it away, and I will then start with my curl and iron. As you see, I pinned away this section. I'm working on the bottom part of this section. I'm gonna take my curl and iron again, starting midway down, and in a horizontal section, I will curl that hair, utilizing my two inch curl and iron. We are now moving to the back area. We'll repeat the steps as we did in the front, more in a horizontal sectioning way. Again, moving in with the two inch curl and iron, I'm going to move the hair out of the way, starting with the bottom nape area. As I just sectioned off the hair, it gives me this area to add my curl to it, my wave. And I'm going to go in there with my two inch curl and iron. And I am going to start with my curl. And we're going to proceed with this sectioning from the nape to the crown area to finish off this look. So I continued this up towards the crown area and finished off my curls with my curl and iron. At this point, we're gonna let it settle in for about 10 to 15 minutes and cool down. Then we will take the hair out, brush it out, 
a little hairspray, and we'll have our look. At this point, the hair has cooled down. So we're gonna start by removing all the curls and start with removing the pins with clips, section at a time. Angela, she looks just like Jessica Chastain. So tell me really quickly, what did you do? Well, very easy few steps. I used a little bit of product, curl and iron, hairspray, a few pin curls, and we were done. Wow, well it looks gorgeous, and you look beautiful. All right guys, so for more on what Angelo does, you can follow him on Twitter at 80 underscore salon, and the next time you're in New York, you have to stop by the Angela David Salon. Thank you so much for coming. Thanks.